What's going down, Watchdog fans? Legions just came out with a brand new update. TU 3.1 comes to us live with some global fixes, Xbox and PlayStation specific. Let's go ahead and jump into it. My name is Matt here at the MacGyver 7 channel, and today we'll be covering some Ubisoft related news. First, let's go ahead and address the elephant in the room, which we have the online in the horizon and there's some tactical stuff that you can check out for see how the gameplay works in the overview through their version of it but let's go ahead and see what changed since the online mode will now be coming out on march 9th so we have about a week and some days and we'll be actually getting there for exciting for a lot of people out there uh, looking at the bug fixes there in futures for the next couple of weeks they'll be making some stuff for as far as the missing masks now for as far as the global fixes that come into scoped portions of fixes an issue where an audio would sometimes cut off when in the Baruch Arena, on top of the crashes that would sometimes occur when the loading into the game, added the translations to the radio for the HUD menu, fixed the issues where the players were unable to fast forward if the drone was near a fast forward prompt. Various crashes fixed all platforms, clip issues for the fixed portions of various outfits, fixed crashes when occurring in PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X for ray tracing when turned on, which hopefully will fix a lot of the water, um, just like the anti-aliasing. It looks really nasty. I don't know if anyone's seen that. Like um, everything else looks kind of pretty good. Like it's pretty smooth for the most part that I've seen through fixes. Leave a comment down below though, if you have uh, what system and what you've been affected by. I'd be very curious to hear what the community has to say. Now, smoothing the portions back to fixes, as we're gonna to try to pave to a nice stability as we get to our online in the next few weeks, we can see that where we have the photo booth, which was an issue to not be available if saved or loading while in it. On top of that, the bikes have now learned that flying is not appropriate if they clip the curb at a high speed. Oh, damn it, you could fly? What the? I No one? I didn't think it was going to be an episode of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang in Watch Dogs Legion. But moving on past that 1968 nice little film that hit the silver screen, we can see that the bikes will no longer do that. When the fixed issues hit the buildings and the lights that would pop on and off as you walked away from them like they were some kind of smart lights. On top of that, you would have the fixed issues where you would have the crashes that occurred entering the clothing stores during the driving to distraction. That is going to be a mission that's going to be basically more dialed in. Now looking at the specific portions of Xbox and now we can see where PlayStation comes down. In PlayStation we can just cross off the list. Let's go ahead and do that before we go to the Xbox because it literally just says speech to text features inactive on PlayStation 5 which I don't think anyone complained too bad about. Moving on though for Xbox you can see that crashes would occur sometimes for resuming the game when it's suspended in a sleep mode. Audio language and selections for as far as sometimes inside of the rest which again would fall into sleep mode and the games that would not respond and the second controller and the consoles switched into the different profile to another. On top of that the issues come down to audio would be muted when swapping inside of the profile. So at this point in time this is a very nice short brief update everyone hopefully everyone's having a fun time i'll be setting up for a nice episode for this so we can all check out to see that speech to text on playstation 5 i think that'd be kind of fun everyone can have a nice little situation but if you're new to the network you can always like share and subscribe you can crack that liberty bell straight down the center so you can get all the notifications for all the future updates that come with ubisoft and game related news have a nice day good luck out there everyone and i'll see you in the future